Hi, I'm Omar and I'm a programmer. Today I'm going to show you how to make your desktop icons invisible on a Mac. Now you want to use the terminal app to do this because that is the only way to do it. Um, so go ahead and fire up your terminal. You should be fi it should be found in the utilities folder or you can use Spotlight to open it up. I'm going to use Spotlight and you can follow along. So I have the terminal app open, and the first thing you want to do is change the directory to desktop. And you can do so by just following what I'm typing, which is cd space desktop, exactly as I typed it. Now you want to check the directory listing to see what's there. And you, to do that, you just type ls. See, I have a file called chair.jpg, which you can see on the bottom right-hand corner of the screen right here. I'm going to go ahead and make that invisible. The way to do this is you want to make an invisible directory. And the, and the way to do that is type mkdir space dot private backslash invisible dir. You can call this anything, anything you want, but I'm just going to call it invisible dir. Now once that's done, you want to move the file over to the invisible directory. And the command for that is mv space hyphen i space chair.jpg and then space pri dot private backslash invisible dir. Now, as soon as I pressed enter, you saw that the chair disappeared from the bottom right hand corner of the screen. That's where my desktop is. Everything else stayed the same. Now let's say I want to bring that chair back. So what we do is change our directory to the dot private backslash invisible dir directory. I, I made a typo over there. Invisible dir directory. And uh, check the listing out and you see chair.jpg is over there. You follow the same steps to move it back to the desktop. It's actually easier. All you have to do is type mv space chair.jpg space dot dot. And when, you do, when I do that, you see that the chair moved back onto the desktop where it was. I'm Omar, and I just showed you how to make icons invisible on your Mac desktop. Have a good day.